everyone, welcome to Easy Math with Miss Easley, SpaceX style. Come along with me to the Starbase production site in Boca Chica, Texas. SpaceX is an American spacecraft manufacturer company founded by Elon Musk. They build space vehicles that consist of the first stage super heavy booster and the second stage spacecraft also named the Starship. So that's what you're looking at in the background here. And we're going to use this really cool site to start searching for different types of lines and angles. I see so many cool examples of that here at this site, so let's get started. Okay, so before we get into our scavenger hunt, let's take a look at the three different types of angles that you're going to be looking for. So angles are just uh, another name for a corner. So if you take a look at this one, that could be a corner of a shape. So could this one with a vertex there, and so could this one. Okay, so some, of, some angles are smaller than a square corner. So a square corner is 90 degrees, and these types of angles over here are less than 90 they are called acute. And I like their name because it makes me think a cute little angle. And so it helps me to remember that it is small, smaller than 90. Okay, then we have perfect square corners and we can also call them a right angle. Okay, and then we have angles that are larger than a right angle, larger than 90 degrees. Those are called obtuse. I like to say obtuse as a moose, and that helps me to remember that they're large. Now I want you to pause the video and look for as many different angles as you can find in this photo. Okay, so now I'm sure you found a lot, probably a lot more than I'm going to show you on the screen, but now let's take a look at some of my examples, see if you found the same things. Okay, so here's my first one. What kind of angle do you see in blue? Okay, good job. It's acute. It's smaller than a right angle. Okay, now what kind of angle do you see in orange there? Awesome, obtuse, it's larger than a right angle. Okay, now what angle do you see in red down there in the corner? Okay, great, I see a square corner or a right angle. Great job. All right, now I wanna take a look at some of the different lines that we're going to be hunting for. So here are some different lines that you're going to notice with different shapes or just diff in different situations. So some lines can be running alongside each other. They make me think about train tracks and those are called parallel. I love the word that the word parallel has two L's next to each other and those make parallel lines. So it helps me to remember uh, that this is what parallel means. And if you also think about it this way, if you kept drawing those lines forever and ever in the same direction, they're never going to touch. So that's another good test to see if lines are parallel. Okay, then we have these two lines. They're crossing right there and they are called intersecting. Intersecting. So um, we're gonna talk about why these two lines, they're also intersecting, but there's a special um, way that they're intersecting, special angles that they make. So let's take a look at this one and see what makes these two different. So what kinds of angles are these two lines creating? What kind of angle is this? Think about the angles that we just talked about. Okay, awesome. They make right angles. Okay, and these are called perpendicular lines. 
So when, when two lines touch or cross and they make right angles, they are called perpendicular. So we can use this plus sign to notice that, but we can also use all sorts of different shapes. So if I just draw a square, this has perpendicular lines because it's creating a square corner or right angle. It also has parallel lines because this line right here is parallel to this line right here. So now we're gonna hunt for these in our pictures. Now I want you to pause the video again and this time hunt for those lines that we just talked about. Let's see how many you could find. Okay, now let's check your work with some of my examples. Of course, you probably found a lot more than I did, but let's dig in. Okay, first, I want to see what you think about these green lines. What are those called? You got it. They're parallel because they don't touch. And if you kept drawing them on and on forever in the same directions, they would never touch. Okay, now let's, let's take a look at the pink lines. What could you call those? Okay, awesome. Intersecting lines. They cross, but they don't make right angles. Okay, now last one. What about the yellow lines? What can we call those? Okay, awesome. Perpendicular because they cross and they form square corners or right angles. Great job. The goal of SpaceX is to make it to the moon and eventually colonize Mars. So it's crazy to think that some of these parts that you're seeing in this video could eventually end up on Mars. I hope this helps you in your math class or at home. Bye.